Hey everyone, in this video, I'll be covering how to integrate my asset, the combat component, with the default third person template. Once you've added it, open up your third person character blueprint and we're going to add the combat component. Then open the combat player blueprint and copy these nodes and paste them over to the default third person blueprint. You'll want to connect the movement nodes for forward and backwards and left and right into the respective sections. Then open the skeletal mesh of the combat character, highlight everything, right click, and copy selected sockets. Open the skeletal mesh of the third person skeleton, click the root, and paste the sockets. Now, with both of them open, let's show asset detail windows and we're going to assign each skeleton to the other. This allows for both skeletons to share animations. Next, under the default skeleton, click this gear icon and select show retargeting options. Under root, select recursively for animation scaled and at spine 01, set recursively skeleton. This keeps the skeleton from stretching. I'm not sure why it happens, but this is how you would fix it. In the default animation blueprint, click class settings and add the ABI combat component. This adds the combat interface, allowing for my combat animation blueprint data to transfer over to the default animation graph, allowing you to continue working off your own animation blueprint. In the animation graph, drag the combat link and put it after main states and directly to the output pose. We are bypassing the default slot and the control rig because my asset does it for you by default. If you don't bypass it, you're going to get double the foot IK logic, lifting your feet above the ground. Compile, save, and then click this purple node, select instance class as ABP combat, and set these bools to true. Lastly, double click on the combat link and connect the input to output. Now you're all done. You can drop a weapon into your level, pick it up, and start using it all the while still using the default third person blueprint and animation blueprint. If you have any questions or need help, feel free to reach out. Plates.